I think the stairs are over here, I'm assuming. Oh my god. Some serious death happened here. This guy might be kid. Take it slow, I might have to sneak up on him. I didn't kill him, I didn't kill him. I'll take the VPO out. Healing. Oh my god, there's two of them! Yeah, there's two of them. adventure. We're going to start a hardcore account. As you can see, we're on a brand new account. Brand new, obviously I've got Edge of Darkness, but it's a brand new account. So what basically this will be, is it's just, I'm just going to basically be limiting myself a lot more than obviously Tarkov normally does anyway. Um, so, well, let's get started by, uh, straight out of the way. <laughs> uh, let's get started on deleting absolutely everything here. So basically, what is going to happen is there's just a couple of more rules that I've got to go through compared to normally playing Tarkov. So, first of all, well, I'll basically just go through the rules while I'm doing this. <laughs> um, so first of all, I can't buy anything from traders. So, uh, they're just completely unusable. Um, obviously, I can use the repair but that that's not from the money that I get from selling things so I basically I can sell things to get their levels up but I can't um, like use anything so they have so if I do come out with stuff and I don't need it I can use it to like obviously level them up because they need that to do quests <coughs> but any money that isn't from in raid or from tasks that I do from them I I, I can only use that to repair and so that's how I'll obviously do my hideout. So obviously things are going to be quite slow. <laughs> but but we are just got to basically get through the missions as fast as we can. Obviously trying to get a lot of stuff. Um, I can't insure anything. That's another thing I can't do. Uh, so anything I can take in, obviously I'm just going to lose. Um, my container, well we will be swapping this to an alpha container. Delete that now. Yeah. Wait, what? What do you mean item is incompatible? Oh, it's a... Oh, fucking hell. Shit. <laughs> Did I just delete my only container? <laughs> what? Oh, fuck. Have I just made this, like, way more hard? I thought that was... I've, I'm such an idiot. I thought that was an alpha container. <laughs> Wait, can I buy an alpha container? Oh my god. Wait, is there one offense? <laughs> I've already fucked this already. <laughs> wow, I'm such an idiot. What am I gonna do? Because I can't reset my account. Oh my god. I'm such an idiot. I totally thought they gave you an alpha container as well. Is there someone I could buy an alpha container from? Like, from level 1? Wait. I'll be right back. I'll be right back. <laughs> Give us a sec, I've got to sort this out. Well then, I just found out that apparently you can't get an alpha container till, uh, till Peacekeeper level 2, or obviously I could get one off the flea market. Fence doesn't seem to have one, so I don't know what to do. So I guess I'm, this is going to be the ultra hardcore <laughs> version of this where I don't get a container either. So that's going to make it very hard to use keys. But I mean, as soon in, I mean, obviously, I, I guess I'll give it to this, the once I've got the flea market, I'm allowed to go and use that to buy one. Um, but yeah, kind of, uh, kind of fucked, <laughs> basically. So that was a complete 
fuck up by me. Totally thought that pistol case was an alpha container. Just, oh my god, I'm such an idiot. I mean, oh well, I mean, <laughs> at least it was funny. I mean, I didn't know what, I, I literally was like, so frantic, like, what am I gonna do now? But I guess this is it, I guess this is just the way it's gotta be. Because I can't reset my, uh, my account again, because I takes a, I think you can only do it every like three weeks or something like that. So I guess we just go ahead with it. <laughs> I mean, I'll quickly grab my tasks. That we start off with, might as well. I mean, I can't put sailors into my thing so I can use them now. I literally just got pockets. But, yeah. Uh, well, let's just go, I guess. <laughs> well, alright, where, so where are we going to go first? Um, hmm. Uh, where should we go? Well, I mean, they've all got merits to go first, but, I mean... Go shoreline, go house on the hill, try and get something there. Try and get out of a safe sort of game. Maybe hit up like the... I mean, that's the thing, they don't have a lot of weapon crates unless I go to the center. I guess there's a lot of Jaeger caches. Uh, reserve. There's a lot of weapons there, but... I don't know if I could get out. That's the problem. Reserve is so hard to extract. The... I'm actually terrified that I would get something, but then I'd just be screwed getting out of there. Um... So I don't know about that one. Factory would just be too frantic. The only thing I could do is probably sit in a corner for about five minutes and wait for everyone to kill someone. And then scurry out, grab shit and leave. Um, woods, I could do. I mean, there's quite a few places to grab stuff there, like weapons and stuff like that. And like the little um, bunkers. But if I get seen by someone, I'm just screwed. Like, literally screwed. There's no getting away. Um, customs. Uh... Might be alright, I, I think I need a lot of keys to be honest, because even if I, I couldn't go to to dorms, because it'd just be a death wish. I could go like relay and stuff like that and quickly. Yeah, I mean, I'm guessing customs might be good for it. For, and I'm guessing if I do get any scout kills, that'll be a good help, a good start. Um, interchange, ooh, that'd be tough. That'd be really tough. I think there'd be a lot of scout. I think we're going to go customs, I think. I think that's probably the best to start off. Yeah, go around this time now. No, it's not super bright, it's getting dark. Just sort of move around. Can't ensure anything. Uh, Alright, let's get into it. Let's go. Oh yeah, while we're uh, loaded in, I guess I'll explain the rest of the rules because we kind of got a bit sidetracked after the uh, horrendous mistake. <laughs> um, well, the next rule is basically the keys and... Doc, documents, key, uh, key bars, and wallets can be ki only things we kept in a container. But I guess we won't. We need to like even have that rule anyway because I don't have one. Um, yeah, I can I can barter with traders. I'm not allowed to map, but who the fuck uses maps anyway? You can s you can sell extra gear to like level traders. Um, yeah, and I'm not. The, basically, the final rule is I can't use a scab, and that's it. So it's PMC only. Um, yeah, I mean I'm pretty scared because if this goes wrong. We're gonna go, and we don't have a gun. We're gonna go down to one percent health, which is gonna make things very tough. <laughs> so we're, ho I'm hoping we can get to something quick. Maybe grab a gun, because if at least we die with a gun, at least that's, at least we maybe have a better chance on the second run. But yeah, we just gotta hope we don't come, because this late into a wipe, man, is gonna be some, uh, some rough people walking around. <laughs> All right, that's. After four minutes of waiting, <laughs> uh, let's hope we get a good spawn. I'm hoping I, to be honest, I actually spawn over near ZB. Uh, is it ZB11? ZB11, ZB12? Hopefully, I can get in some of those buildings because I'm hoping there should be. Oh, where are we? Oh, dear, this is probably the worst. Oh, shit. <laughs> All right, let's get to radar. That's probably my best bet. Just pick up a gun and hot and be fucking ready. Because there's two weapon boxes here, or three maybe. Oh. Give me something, give me something, give me something. No! Oh. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, what's this? Oh! 1062, okay, give, give it to me. Oh my god. Let's keep this bad boy on single fire. Oh my god, I haven't played so long, I'm fucking forgetting the buttons. Right, we've got a PS rounds, right, sick. 
I don't know if I should go for this other weapon box. I feel like someone's going to be close. Let's just do it quickly. Because there's meds in here as well, which would be really fucking sick. Oh, don't care, don't care. Grab these for now. Oh shit, I'm really... There's someone going to be coming up this hill soon. I don't know if I should just wait here, maybe try and pop them. Oh, AI too, that's fucking lovely. Army bandage, army bandage. Get out of here, all of you. I need all of them. Alright. Just listen for a sec. We've got PS rounds, so the rounds are a bit shit. We need to start moving towards the exit, maybe try and get a scav kill on the way. Um, I don't really want to go round. Don't really want to go round um, dorms. It's going to be fucking hell over there. Because maybe we can pop some people at trailer park. They're fucking moving. Oh, I'm so. There's a Jaeger stash down here. I can barely hit. Holy fuck! That's over there. I'll stay out of that. Whatever that is. Oh man, to be honest, I'm very happy that we found a gun straight out of the bat. That's very good. I don't know if that was at dorms or whether that was. Some were very close. I heard him running. Don't think he heard us. Well, he has stopped. Close. I can hear him. He's literally on the other side of this wall, I think. Guy seems very aggressive. I it might be a scav. Don't know whether to push him or not. And I'm gonna have like no arm strength. Got one clip to end this dude. Man, I want to run so badly. This gun is worth a lot to us. He doesn't understand. He will never understand how much this gun means to us. Oh, I've got no arm strength. Shit. Can we just make for a run for it? Yeah, we're moving. I'm going to make a run for it for a better position. Whenever it dorms. Holy fuck. That guy had our fucking number there. Oh. It may have just been a scav because I'm assuming we're thingy and tagged. Like, um, marked and tagged. It may have, that may have been just a scav spooking me because it was so robotic how he moved when we moved along. He just like instantly started sprinting. I don't know. Scared me the same. <laughs> it was just, it was just almost like, it was very odd. I don't want to check out this campsite. Someone's been through. Got some behind. We can sneak past dorms. Someone's been a second. Well, tooth story. So intense. The rush I've been waiting for. Problem is when you don't give a shit about any of your gear in Tarkov, it really doesn't. It really takes the sort of the edge off of it. <laughs> but when you're playing like this, my god. 
this shitty AK becomes like a the Holy Grail, <laughs> and that makes it kind of fun. Let's try and get past here without alerting anyone. Ooh. All been on top floor. We we'll just just kicked a door down. We can run for it. Oh, it's so dangerous! Very dangerous. Ooh. Ooh. Guys, we, we're full now. I think we try and just get to the end. I'm gonna leave this right now. And get to the end. And maybe we can pop a scab or two, try and grab their backpacks or something like that. Because trying to fucking take any of this shit is going to kill me. And you know, I can hear M4s and shit like that going off. Oh, no smuggled. Fuck. Oh my god. I tip. <laughs> we can pop him, we can grab his bag and shit quickly. Just can't get greedy. God. Don't run for me, bro. There we go. Oh, he's down. Let's cross over. And we'll cross over again. Holy shit, this is this is fucking scary. Let's do this quickly. Smuggler's open. I don't think he had a backpack though, annoyingly. Better than nothing. Oh fuck. It's got a scav vest, sick. Oh my god. Oh my god, you entire helmet, not what I want. It's got a knife though. Put that knife on. Get in a bush quickly. Right, we got so we got a pistol. That's good. That's good. Nice bit of ammo there. Here's someone running. We right, got half a. Oh my god, that bird! That bird just scared the shit out of me. <laughs> All right, let's get out of here. Let's get out. Of here. We've got some good loot. So smugglers open. I couldn't. I don't think I can see the light. Nah, it's not open. I better see smoke and the light. I'm trying to get to the crossroads now. Just gonna hope we don't see any fucking little campy boys. Well, let's check our thing. There's nothing red. We're all good on that. Oh my. What happened here? Some dude got fucking popped here. He's been rinsed of all his stuff. I thought he was just a. Maybe he's another dude doing a hardcore can. <laughs> I might try and hit this weapon box that's down here. This in this. Uh, extract. Maybe I'll have some easy stuff. We've got a scab vest now. Oh, this is one of those ones where you have to run in and out every time. I'm gonna have to. Oh. Let's take it, <laughs> I guess. Wow, we did it. Well, that went surprisingly well. I didn't even. Well, I guess I didn't even see a key, so it didn't really matter. I didn't have a pouch. But. Yeah, got one scav kill, even though I'm feeling a bit rusty and I missed him about 10 times. But yeah, good early game haul, good first raid, didn't get killed. All good. Wow, I'm surprised. I'm genuinely surprised. I thought I was going to get popped straight away. But I mean, I'm assuming if I tried to fight that guy, whew, that would have just gone wrong. But yeah, good first raid. All right, I've had a cunning plan. The uh, pistol we got in the last game got a little flashlight on it. So, we're going to Nighttime Factory. 
<laughs> this could go very, very badly. But it may go really well. Because if we can get some scav kills, or maybe even just loot some dead PMCs from other ones, we'll be in the money. We get quite a few. I've not brought anything with me. I've not brought any meds. Just brought some ammo. For this pistol. And hopefully we can grab a few things. Um, yeah. Oh man, straight in. Man, this is going to be scary. There's going to be some high level people here. I'm really worried. <laughs> this. Oh no. There's going to be just some monster running around, isn't there? This may have been a really bad idea. But let's go with it because I, I actually kind of love Nighttime Factory. It's actually, it's actually really funny. Uh, Alright, let's see where we spawn. Hopefully somewhere good. I hope I hope I'm not anywhere near um oh, where are we? Here, what what sort of spawn is this? I don't want to push over there. I'd rather Oh my god. Oh my god. He was not expecting that. Fucking hell. Oh, it's a scav. Is it a scav? Yeah. Yes, yeah, scav. I can take his aid off. Fucking hell. It's fucking shit. I'm not really going to be able to use it because I need the light. Oh, man. That, why did he, he just ran straight at me straight away? Wanna have some meds in oh it's got rubles though. Ten grand, that's gonna give me a lot of help. Some get some Oh fuck, we've got a good key. what key is this? East room, that might wow, that might be really good. But well we've got no container. Oh fuck. Alright, now we do we just get out or Oh man, I forgot that we don't have a factory coup. I'm so used to having a factory coup, we've only got one extraction. Um, how do we get over there? I'm guessing we've got to push around, go through cellars. Hopefully, there's no one there. Uh, I think that's our best shot because if we go over the top, we're going to have to go through office. No one said anyone see my flashlight. Oh my fucking god! <laughs> That's a dude. That was a dude. Oh my god. Look at that. Oh, we need to go through here. That guy was kitted. Someone knows we're here. Everyone's got fucking night vision. God, this is spooky. Someone above us. As soon as we hear it, we're gonna put that flashlight on and blind him. Someone definitely above us. As soon as we hear that metal, we're gonna have to. He's gonna see us. He's on wood. Oh, yeah, he's in. He's in. I can hear him. He's in, inside on the in the showers. I can hear him on the floors. What do we do? We can't go that way. That guy's gonna kill us. We can't go this way. I literally hear him on it, on, in, in the centre of it, just sprinting round. Literally sitting here in the pitch black. <laughs> this is probably so boring. All right. I hate that I do that. Someone's on metal. That's on the other side. What do I do? I can't push back. I've got to push. I can't push through. He's just going to be like so kitted. Yeah, that's an MP. That's an MP9. Fighting.
No one's seeing a thing. I get to gate three and get out without being seen. This oh no. That's not good. I hate that I do that by accident. It's if I hold shift it the pulls back my gun, it doesn't turn my flashlight on. I just go for it. Closed. There's gonna be someone in here. No, no, we're okay. Someone in here. Oh my god. How did we get out of that? Alright. Hold off. Woo! Man. What am I supposed to do? Everyone's, so, everyone's going to be so kitted. What am I supposed to do? I mean, we got some good... Yeah, we got a, we got a good kill there. From that guy that just ran at us for some reason. Came out with a good ADAR. Oh, man. That was way more intense than the customs game. <laughs> like, that guy sp spooked me so much. The guy just came from around the wall. Man, I'd love to have stayed there and fought him, but he was just... I could tell that he was kidding. There's no way even our radar bullets would have done anything. And I definitely wouldn't have been able to see him. Maybe until we get a better gun that can... Actually, we can survive with a flashlight on. Maybe... Maybe we hold off on the night time. Uh, the, the night time raid. But all together, man. We're doing a good start. I haven't, haven't had any uh, good damage on myself. Kill two scouts are all good. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. All right, we're going for it. Third time's a charm. We got two nice little victories in the bag. Let's go for a big reserve play. I think. I mean, I think we'll be able to get some good stuff here. I think it's probably one of the best ones that's just got like free loot in it. But it's just getting out that's going to be difficult. So we need to, uh, yeah, just grab some stuff. I've brought. I've got a scab vest with me now. At least that's some room for like some double space ones. Because I mean, I'm going to have to start finding those five sailors. Which is going to be an absolute pain because I'm going to want to keep them. But I'm guessing I can give them in when they're like already low. So I can use them just like out of raid. But yeah. Guessing we'll just see where we spawn. We've got this AK. It's only got 21 bullets in it. But if maybe we see a raider, we might be able to pop him. Just because it, it is 762 ES. So it's a little bit better than if it was 545. But... Man, does it kick like a brick shit house. <laughs> yeah, let's get into it. Alright, let's get going. Let's just hope for a good spawn. I hope I'm not out in the middle of the nook, like, in the open. It's going to be a pain trying to get into a building. The problem is with reserve is probably the map I know the least out of all of them. Like, I definitely play it the least in my, when I was playing normal as a PNC, just because... Extracting with it is so hard. You can get some really good shit, but just my god is it hard to extract <laughs> compared to the other ones. Oh, alright, where are we? Oh fuck, we're in the train station. Um I'm guessing let's push down here. Try and get into to get there quick as well, because there's gonna I bet there's gonna be someone spawning to my right. Oh, this is spooky. That this is scuff. Gonna let him go, I think. Get in here. Got no stamina. He definitely heard me. You gonna come in? Hello, Mr. Scabby Scabby. They were moving. Maybe if I jump you. Come in. I can literally hear him on the other side of this wall. Scabs over to the left as well, I can hear. What gonna do? Scabby woo. Uh, oh, he heard me. Hey, Scabby woo. If I literally poke my head out here, I'm dead. 100%. Because I don't want to loot him outside. 
I'm guessing he's not even doing anything, so we might as well just loot here and then he'll be when he's done being a weirdo, he'll come in. But what is going well apparently I'm being a weirdo as well. What is going on? Why can't I get up here? What the Do I literally have to sprint up up here? What? <laughs> how, did, how did I get up so easily the first time and I was... There, there... Oh. I've got... Have I got mental problems? There we go. Jesus. I remember someone got into the roof as well. Holy f... Whoa. Is that... Scav? That shot? A... Damn. Yeah, there we go. That little dickhead's down. Right, let's loop here and then we'll... Oh, that scared me. I didn't even see him. Really, I'm really scared. Oh my god. Oh no, it's not. I thought it was a presser then. That... No, it's just a... Oh, it is on the... 1x4. Oh my god, it does! It's sick. <laughs> oh my god, that's horrible. Um, just stuck on four times. That is horrendous. It's kind of nice, but if I see anyone close, I'm so fucked. Oh, come on, let me out. I'm making so much noise. How the fuck? I swear you can jump out of here. I don't want to go all the way round. I'm going to just get murdered straight away. I def you definitely can get it through here. There we go. Did it. So janky sometimes. <laughs> oh, don't want to kick pitch that. Oh my god. That, that'll scare him. No, don't do it again. Jesus. If we meet someone, I'm just going to have to hit fire them into <laughs> non existence. I think I should just take it off for now. And if I need it, need it, then I'll put it back on. That's an eye fact just there. Beautiful. Oh my god, two eye facts. Oh my god. Just try and get this shit out of here. Oh, where were you? Where were you in my, in my main, main my main game? Why were you so hard to get? I'm taking that because of, oh, oh, a 204. You know, I'll definitely take it, but what do I drop? I mean, this thing, I feel like this is really good. I don't know what to do. I mean, fuck the Euros, to be honest. What am I going to buy with Euros? Like a block piece? There's some shit going on very close to me. Mushroom tape. Scav closed. Got about half a mag. Let's go and loot that scav out there. Hopefully, he's got another gun. They're on the back side of the where we are. Hopefully, there's not another scav. Uh, another AK. Two hundred nine. Oh, it's got a backpack though, that's sick. Oh, my ping speed is so slow. I gotta, gotta take everything. It's all worth it, shit. Oh. Give me that. Just sort this out quickly. Alright, I'm guessing stick with the 7.62 for now. As long as we've got ammo for that, that's way better than this uh, 209 is going to be. Right, where can we go? The problem is if we didn't have this backpack, we could have got out of sewer manhole. But, I'm guessing we can't do that now. Try and, try and get to D2, I guess. Move over to this other side. Got to get underground. Is that in this? No, that's a little bit further away, definitely. That's a little bit too muffled. 
I think it's that building over there we can get into. That'll take us downstairs and we get to D2. Someone above us. Oh. Where's the stairs? They definitely know we're here. That's the below. Taking this very sk very slowly. Definitely heard him. Hopefully he'll come in. Oh, we'll pull of us. Oh, oh, he's dead. We get upstairs. That's definitely more bull of them. They'll work a way through. Literally sounds like it. Yeah. We're really doing this stealthily. Gotta be, we've got no armor, there's no way we can just rush in and tank, tank him down. I think the stairs are over here, I'm assuming. Oh my god. Some serious death happened here. This guy might be kid. Take it slow, we might just sneak up on him. I didn't kill him, I didn't kill him. I'll take my VPO out. He's healing. Oh my god, there's two of them! Yeah, there's two of them. Fuck. Fuck. I thought, I knew there was two of them. Why did I rush? I should have held back. Fuck. Man, that was good. That was a fun raid though, fuck me. Oh man, Ooh, that was intense. I could just hear him running around and it's just like, yeah, I, I normally I didn't, I definitely just tapped that guy in the chest loads. I couldn't just like angle myself up enough. <laughs> that was so frustrating. Oh man, this got a level up, eh? A level three, but, Ooh. well, guess I'm gonna have to deal with this now. This is how hardcore is gonna be. Well, hopefully we can make it up in the next raid. Ooh.